shout out to Luis dong for lending me his bike. I'm going to discuss uh, some points, no? Why you should consider buying um, Rusi Classic 250 if you are into classic bikes. for us to review this bike we'll just give it with the pros and cons of the bike um, yeah so I guess we'll start with the pros the very first thing that you will notice about this bike no is that it really is a very good looking bike uh, and all its competitors no um, within the same um, level of motorcycle getting in a classic look um, we could start with this one the Russi classic 250 the 152 Kiwi cafe racer 152 um, the Skygo I forget the name but it looks just like the Kiwi and the motor star uh, Z250 I guess was it Z250 yeah so with all of uh, it I guess this is the most good looking one sa ilahang mga variant sa ilahang, sa ilahang, sa ilahang level it has this matte finish matte grey finish and very manly and it has a variety of other colors as well um, you can have that as a huang nebawaan there's this new um, quite brown thing brown colored uh, Rusi 250 and the black one and this one which is the gray one I guess this is the matte gray one yeah so yeah that's it and you should uh, another uh, the second uh, thing about this bike is that um, aside from its looks given that it is a 250cc bike it can deliver uh, much power so kanang justifiable rasha na 250cc siya because it is powerful it's torquey and uh, just to let you know this is a carb type motorcycle dili pa siya katong FI but we cannot test the, I cannot test the fuel efficiency of this one because it does not have the one um, the one that it will only you know uh, compute for itself but based on the owner uh, it's not that um, it's not that consuming man sa gas pot so you know it pays for the price if it's so beautiful then you gotta pay for it and yeah, that's the Kiwi one. Yeah. Another pro thing about this bike is in its um, mga other competitors, no. It has two disc brakes in front, very big um, brake rotors in front, so uh, it's good in front, and it has at the back. It has the wheel shock at the back with um with canister yeah and you will really notice no the, the power of this bike is really there so wala joy wala kay bating ang makanangkuan so another good thing about this bike is that it has very fat tires dual sport tires which is very 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 good and so 
I have already given three. Uh, first is its looks. Second is um, the power. Third is the um, I forgot <laughs> big tires. Yeah, the big tires. We will talk about the cons on this bike. It's not necessarily bad thing or not. It's not. It's something that I don't like. It's just something that I think they can improve. So, and it's very little things, no? Nah, you don't want to notice. Very little things. So the very first thing, no? Ako ang nabasayan on this bike is that. Its accelerator won't go back on its own right away. Now uh, I'll show you. Uh. It's not fast enough. It cannot just. You know. Like that. And second thing is that its um, speedometer is quite delayed no um you should delay in when it's going up it's delay when you're going down just very little things no like okay the bike is very beautiful you cannot uh you cannot really see much of a problem in here so yeah that's it yeah this this bike has a very loud pipe no um this is not the stock one but in uh you'll be mistaken uh stock pipe measure no it's not stock pipe it's a bullet pipe